Hello there. Today I bought this fish and I'm going to try a recipe from the Gordon Ramsay book. I've never tried it before. This is a red mule with orange and fennel. Fennel. Fennel? Fennel? Bingo. This, ladies and gentlemen, is... Well, it's missing a label. It looks like a fennel to me. Hmm, anise? Well, it looked like a fennel to me. The guy said anise and the fennel are the same thing. I think I'm just gonna believe him. And here it is. The fruit of my labor. Ah, fennel, or anise. Although, last time I was in Italy, they used anise to flavor bread. Everywhere, everywhere you go, they flavor with anise. Let's wash everything. Ah, good. Now, I've never dealt with this thing before, so I have no idea how to cut it, but I'm assuming you trim off the ends as usual. Very gently, and then chop it all up. Chop, 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 chop. Into the bowl. Next. Next, grab some of those chili peppers. Very hot ones. Yes, this one. One is more than enough. Three. Inferno. So, very gently slice them. Very thin. Make sure you wash your hands after doing this because your hands are gonna burn up. Mix that up nice and gentle. And now, my favorite part. The oranges. So we get a cup for an, for the orange juice, and let's cut the orange very carefully, trying to cut off as much flesh as possible. That's right. You should be a bad surgeon. Nah, I'm just kidding. I just don't know what I'm doing. So now let's cut this up, nice and tiny, like a tomato. Ooh, that nice shirt. Ramsey suggests a very sophisticated technique for preparing oranges. I think I have something much simpler in mind. Press it like this. And whatever juice you have left, drain it into the cup. There's not much really. Nothing to see here. I just made that technique up. That is the last of it. Now go get yourself a nice slice of parchment paper. So, according to Gordon Ramsay, we have to take the baking parchment, make a crust in the middle, la 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 la, make a crust in the middle, la la la, fold it in half. So, get your parchment, unfold it, and actually, I'm not sure why you fold it. Na 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 na. Okay, got it. Christ, I hate reading books, seriously. Got your parchment paper, pin it, get that fish, ocean perch. Oh, well, it'll have to do. Always remember to wipe your fish with paper towel. Put it on the parchment. Add some fennel. Some chili peppers. Not too much. You don't want to die, do you? And some oranges. And add a little bit of olive oil. Just a little bit. Fold it into a nice little package. And just before the end, apparently you drizzle some of that orange juice in there. And some white wine. White wine, just a little bit. You don't want this thing to cause an apocalypse. Well, there it is, all washy-washy. Switch the oven on to 400. Do, do, do. Fahrenheit, of course. Baking sheet. Put the packages on. I got a lot of fennel still left. Well, I gotta split it between these three. Splish. 
a good idea to hold these together might be using um, toothpicks. I just have to put all the packages on the baking tray. Oh, they don't fit. Or do they? Move over, you. And once you're done, stick them in the oven. Um, slight modification. <laughs> the oven could be a little lower. Well, actually, why does it make a difference? It should be better like this. But voilà. actually, like this, the paper could catch fire. So that's why I have to put it on the lower grill. For God's sake. And 10 or 15 minutes should be more than enough for the fish. Oh, so heavy. Ooh, look at that. It's a steaming package. Let us carefully unearth this godly present. That looks beautiful already. But what about the taste? Oh, I forgot to add salt and pepper. Blime. Fish doesn't need a lot to cook. And this one is certainly done. But, mmm. The chili tomato ice paste. Ah, hot like fire. Ooh, well, that's good. Good dinner. At least it's simple to make. Mmm, in fact, incredibly good. Until, until next time, damn you, Gordon Ramsay, and all your chilies. Ah, but it's good. It's just, mm, it's just fantastic.